Hi guys, I'm here today with a monster sale haul from Next. My name is Fawn and this is my channel and it's a happy place. It's a place where I do a lot of shopping. Um, I do some unboxings, I do do some chatter and I've been doing a little bit of decoration lately but it is mostly shopping as I'm an addict. If you like that kind of thing, please do give me a thumbs up, click subscribe and leave a comment. Okay ladies, I hit the next sale. I was looking for a couple of specific things and ended up ordering a whole load more. So this very much is a bit like five on Friday. I need to know which ones you think are great, which ones you think are rubbish, because there's no way I'm keeping all of this. Um, well, at least I hope I'm not keeping all of this. <laughs> So first up, I picked up some khaki chino-y trousers. They should be £20, they were £10 in the sale. I love a baggy chino in the summer. I know they're not the most flattering thing in the world and people are gonna say, oh, you know, that's not maybe the best on you. But for comfort and getting things done and gardening and just living, I love a baggy chino. So at £10, they have to be tried. Still in the trouser line, I found these ones. These are a different cut altogether. And they're sort of um, a caramel color, would you say? These were originally, oh, they've colored out the price. I don't know, I think they were 25 originally. And I've paid 14, so maybe they were 28, because I know almost everything was half price. So probably 28, and I've paid 14 for them. These are a sort of a chino-esque, but they're supposed to have short, legs you know not got all the way down to the floor so i'm hoping again that these will be really comfy easy going summer trousers i know i don't really need any more dresses but i love dresses i live and die in them i mean i did some washing and ironing the other day and there were eight dresses in it because it is my go-to outfit i saw this and thought i've got to try it it could look terrible on me but i just have to try it it's navy check it's Midi length, can you see that it's navy check? It's got that sort of square neckline and puffy sleeves, uh, three quarter sleeves. I'm a bit afraid that I am gonna look huge in this thing. Uh, this was 40 pounds originally and I paid 16. So you can see why I wanted to try it. And it's a lovely cotton by the way. Now, the actual reason why I hit the next sale was summer sandals. Um, I'm always really reluctant to pay full price for summer sandals because they never last very long. I don't care what anyone says. I don't find they last very long. So I saw these ones. These are toe post ones. They're like a rose gold. Can you see the glitter on them? They have got a little back ankle strap as well to make them firm. You know, firm. Stay on your feet. You know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> and a wedge heel, but a low wedge heel. Now these were, I don't know why I keep taking my glasses off and on really when I've got to read things. These were originally 29 pounds and in the sale they were 11 pounds 50, which is a phenomenal price. They're beautifully padded inside as well. So I'm really quite keen on these, but this was what actually started the shop, was me looking for some summer sandals. I saw this dress. Now, I'm not sure, it was the colour, you can imagine. It caught me, the colour. I love this sort of green. It's got three quarter sleeves with a, a little frill on the end and elastication. It's V-neck, again, it's sort of gathered here. It's long. Um, I don't know, it's, it's maybe more winter colours. I'm not really sure. It was 38 pounds originally and I paid 15 in the sale. I keep saying in the sale, like something here isn't in the sale. They're all in the sale. Another pair of trousers, but these are joggers. Um, they have the elasticated cuff at the end. They're calling them khaki again. I suppose they are khaki. They're sort of browny color, actually. Elasticated waist, some pockets. These were 28 and I paid 14. See, I'm looking for comfy. You can see there was a theme when I got going with my shopping. <laughs> another dress I'm sorry guys I can't help myself look at the color it's colors that are calling to me at the moment it's got stars all over it it has a little tie waist it's kind of is it elastic no it's just gathered on the back I believe again that that's going to be a three-quarter sleeve maybe full length uh, high collar 
buttons just to the waist and they are genuine buttons so I may run into some problems with this. This was £40 and I paid £19 in the sale. <laughs> These were 25 originally. I paid £11 for them. I mean, they are as flat as flat as can be, which maybe won't be very good for my back because I tend to find if my shoes are a bit too flat, my back arches and then I get backache. But they're silver. They are padded inside. And they've got what I liked was that the straps are clear. I've never had clear strap shoes, but silver, you know, I've got rose gold. So <sighs> they're worth a try. Okay, so that was my... Um, <laughs> that was the clothes. Now I'm going to try them on for you and fingers crossed some of these work out for me. But as I say, it's quite a lot of stuff. I wasn't really planning on keeping it all. So please do wade in. So here we go. Okay, let's we'll start with the berry dress. I love the colour. It's lovely and soft. As I say, it was £40 originally, £19 in the sale. You can see it doesn't fit me. I ordered an 18. I should have known better. Um, next, some of the brands, some of the like subcategories in next can be a bit cut a bit small and this is just i mean it's not just straining it's i mean it's obscene <laughs> it's absolutely obscene you can see why i was going for it i really like the color i can undo this and just yeah if you can imagine <laughs> if i had a top there let me just put something there it's a really pretty dress it's also a lot shorter than i thought it was but it would have worked with leggings if I didn't have the boob situation going on. So for somebody else, this could be a really great buy. And in fact, I may even go, well, I don't know, because it is short. Mm, is it worth, you let me know, ladies, is it worth me going on and seeing if they've got a size up so that, well, I might even need two for these boobs, because they're just, it's not a little bit tugging, it's a lot of bits tugging. Let me do it up again. Do you see? Really bad. Does up again there. <laughs> Does up there, just not literally over the boob. So is it worth it? Do you think it's nice enough? And is it a bit wintry? Is it a bit autumn, winter and we're going into summer? Um, I like this little tie waistness. Um, I like the tears, the fabric is lovely, but I don't know. Come on ladies, help me out. Same situation, much too tight over the boobs again. It's this weight I've gained. God help me, I have got to get back on the diet. Um, also, is it a bit, again, autumn wintry? I mean, I know it is the autumn winter sale, but some things, you know, they cross. I really like the colour. I'm now not so sure about the pattern either. I think it gives me a nice shape, although <gasps> too tight at the moment. Um, the sleeves are great, they will come longer, but they are meant to be sort of here with this frill effect going on. I'm going to give you the back view. Apologies. As you can see, so tight on the back, it's absolutely killing me. And if I come in, can you see it's making, <laughs> I'm getting extra boobs going over the top. They're just so big at the minute. I put all my weight on there, so I'm really suffering. So again, I should have gone up. I think this would be a one size up because everywhere else is fine. Just there. I should have remembered this about next. Um, but I do like it. But I don't know if I'm mad to like it. I don't know whether I'm, I don't know, seeing something that isn't there. Um, would it end up stuck in the wardrobe until autumn? It's hard to tell because it's not fitting. I don't know what I feel. So you're gonna to have to let me know, but I, you know, I really like this green color. Really like it. Fabric's not as nice, but it's ever such a pretty dress, I think. <laughs> okay, last dress, and I like it. The fabric on it is lovely. It's a really thick cotton. I like the gingham. I think the gingham is really, really cute. And because it's black and blue, I don't feel it's too, little girly. I think if it, this was a blue and white check, I'd feel that it was a bit young for me. It fits really nicely. Again, I could do with more room here. Turn around. Um, but I am planning on losing weight and I think I could even get away with it now. I wouldn't bother wearing it now because I would be aware that it's a bit too tight here. If I come in, you could see what I mean. Just that bit too tight there, it's sort of flattening. <laughs> 
flattening the boobs down. But I mean, if I had to, I could wear it now. So I think this one is gonna stay, unless you guys think there is something wrong with it. But I feel like I could wear this in the summer. Um, I think it will transition well when autumn comes round, you know, a pair of boots and a jacket. I, I really like this one. This one feels easy breezy, which is what you know I love about a good dress. Easy breezy. So, oh, I think I forgot to tell you the prices again, didn't I? One minute. Okay, so the green dress was down to £15 from 38 which is such a good deal, isn't it? And this one is down to 16 from 40 there's no way this is going back. I do feel nice in it, even though it's too tight here at the minute. So next up is the trousers and then the sandals. One out of three, but the other ones, that green one, I am awful tempted to see whether they've got it in a bigger size. Please let me know, ladies. Okay, here we go. This is just my old Beatles t-shirt. These are the khaki chinos. Were 20, down to 10 pounds. Tell you what the quality is there, ladies. I don't know what they look like. <laughs> the fit is smashing. It's an 18. The fit is really nice. I like that they're nice and high-waisted. Um, even if they didn't look good, I might be tempted to keep these, you know, just for gardening and messing around. Because 10 quid, when can you get 10 quid trousers like this? Because the quality, as I say, is there. Um, I don't know that trousers are the most flattering thing on me at the minute because of the weight that I'm carrying, but I don't really mind too much in, in a peculiar way. Um, comfort. These are what I wear when I want comfort because I'm going to be doing something like digging or, or dealing with the animals or something where I need to be able to move, feel comfortable, and really almost the look is unimportant. But it would be nice if I knew that they were nice enough that I could be seen in public in them as well. <laughs> so yeah, 10 pounds were 20. Now I just said that I don't mind baggy, but I think these are awful on me. These are just accentuating every bit of me that I hate. These are the ones that I'm not entirely sure how much they were um, originally, but they were £14. Um, I mean, the legs are mahoosive. There's all this extra fabric. They've got pleats of sorts here to make them. I mean, just, <laughs> what can I say, ladies? These are awful. These are definitely going back. The quality is there, and they might look completely different if you're a 10, 12 you know and you can take a little bit of, of fullness but these are just i looked in the mirror and i just started laughing and it's not even a very good mirror it's quite a flattering mirror that's in that room but it made me cackle when i saw them so i don't think these will be staying the color is great though and as i say if you're slim you could probably carry a bit of this but with me i just look at me <laughs> I think they're the best trousers today. Now, I like these a lot. These are the jogger ones. These were 28, they're now 14. There's tons of stretch in them, ladies. They're so comfortable. But the pockets, the fit is nice. I could even maybe have gone down a size, but I do like my comfort. Um, what can I say? Compared to the ones I just had on, it's like night and day. These are definitely staying. I think they are probably my bargain of the day. Um, I mean, I know I've got them on with sandals. I wouldn't wear them with sandals. I'd wear them with my trainers. But these are just, oh, these are easy. Easy breezy. These are fabulous. And I really, really like them. Um, I'm glad these fell into my shopping trolley. <laughs> To my eternal shame, before I go on to the sandals, because that's what I should be doing, I've just found another one that somehow missed being looked at earlier. So I'll just quickly show you and try this dress on. This dress was reduced to £8.50 from 26 so £8.50. It's a, oh, hang on, let me just turn it around. I'm not doing a good job of this, am I? It's quite high necks, I think, which may not work for me. It's jersey, so it's very stretchy. It is long sleeved, but elasticated sleeves. Um, I was visualising it with leggings. Um, I like the fact, or liked the fact, that if you can see, it's a cream and black, not a white and black. So, um, I, I was thinking, 
there's something missing and that's what it is. So I'm going to slip this on and show you this before I do the two pairs of sandals. So it's high necks, which is not usually my favourite. In fact, no, definitely isn't my favourite. But £8.50 and guys, this is an easy dress. Now, I don't know whether I look hideous. Looked in the mirror, thought, oh, not too bad. I look back at these things on here and I go, what was I looking at? Um, I was visualising it, as I say, wearing it with leggings, wearing it with thick tights. This was a sort of more of an autumn winter dress. £8.50, I wouldn't mind if I had to, could only wear it a few times. Then summer came, then I put it away for autumn. I, that's not a problem. Um, it's lovely and comfortable. And I actually quite like the pattern. I think it's quite flattering, I don't know. It does have a little frill on the bottom and there are no pockets, which would have made it perfect. We come in. Now, can you see it's ruched here? Um, so, you know, does that, does that give it enough to distract from what's going on just below it? Does it sort of, I, I don't know, but in my mind, it's taken the emphasis off my chest, which is really nice. So I'm really going to need your advice, guys, because I quite like this, um, so long as I'm not being an idiot. Now, let's just do the two pairs of sandals, and I think I'll have finished. I don't know how long this video is going to be. Oh, please. <laughs> I'm so out of sort of practice at doing larger hauls. Okay, so these are the silver ones with the clear straps over the foot. I don't know whether the clear straps will even show up, to be fair. Um, I don't like them. That's the God's honest truth. They are, as I thought, just that bit too flat. There's no arch support. I need a little bit of a lift to help my back. Also, the positioning of the front strap because you can see there's three let me take one off and show you i'll hold it out to the camera so the positioning of this front strap i don't know if you can see but it goes across my toes near the sort of toner well my little toe is virtually out i know that wearing that for any length of time that particular strap would make my toes really really sore which is a shame because i think it's a pretty you know, it look, it's got the look. It's got the look. It's £11. It's got the look. Um, I like the shiny silver. I like the flat, flat, flat. <laughs> I like the fact that it's just slightly curved here. I like the squareness. You know, it is a padded, also padded shoe, but it's just, there is no support in it. And as I say, the positioning of that strap there, I am hoping you can see on my little toe, I know that that is a recipe for pain. These, on the other hand, are a winner. They are really, really nice. Um, the toe bit is almost of no point. And a lot of people say, oh, I don't like things between my toes. And I can understand that when you're wearing something where that is how you keep your shoe on. But because these have the sort of mule, not mule, <laughs> The strap across the back sling back because they've got the sling back going on you get the look of just a basic sort of flip-flop loose on your foot flinging about but turn to the side I also like the fact that they have this tiny little bit of a wedge it lifts me up it stands me up it helps my back stand I was gonna say straight but you know what I'm trying to say I think these are great. I'll take one off and show you closely. So, these were £29 down to £11.50. So, as you can see, whoops, <laughs> as you can see, there's the wedge, the sling back moment. But, you know, when people look at you from the front, that's what they see. It looks like you're wearing just a flip flop, a sandal. No, it is a sandal. You know what I'm trying to say, a slip on. But actually, you've got the support to allow your foot to feel much, much more stable. These don't feel like they come off. They don't feel like I could overstep them. I mean, I've had sandals in the past, so I don't know about you guys, where I've shot out of them. I've, I've done this, I've twisted my ankle in them. But because these are firmly attached to my foot, they're going nowhere, I feel just as secure as if I was wearing a proper shoe. So these are staying. 
I'm not going to sit down and do a this is this, that is that. I did that at the beginning. I don't know whether I should have really. I think it's made the video really, really long. Like I said, I'm out of the habit of doing big clothing hauls. Um, as you know, I want your views. I want to know, are those two first dresses, would they be worth me asking for them in a bigger size to allow for the tartars? This one, you know, does it work with it being high necks you know i mean like i say 850 and the quality is marvelous um i do love the blue check dress which i think will stay the trousers you know will i get away with those chinos that are, are big but not ridiculous are they worth keeping for doing my uh, household chores and could i wear them down the supermarket we all know the middle pair of trousers <laughs> were the funniest the jogger trousers I, you know the labels are coming off they're going straight in my wardrobe i will be wearing them probably within i was going to say within the week but it's uh, <laughs> we're nearly at the end of the week anyway but i will be wearing them and looking forward to wearing them and i found one pair of sandals which i do like and the other pair not so much so they were all marvelous prices that's why i did it and um apologies to anyone who has an issue with me shopping but it's kind of a shopping channel because I'm an addict and lots of lovely ladies out there are bits of addicts too. And um, yeah, I'm a personal shopper sometimes, even just to help them not make the mistakes that I'm making. <laughs> anyway, um, I hope you're happy. I'm happy. I'm happy that I found a couple of things that I like and dear God, if these boobs get any bigger, I just don't know what I'm going to do. So come Monday, this girl is dieting. Finally! <laughs> See you soon, babes. Bye!